What is scientific reporting? The main purpose of scientific reporting is to communicate the results of your experiments. Scientific reporting is also sometimes called standard report writing. The process of writing a scientific report gives you valuable practice of understanding the theory of a particular experiment. The scientific reports allows you to summarise what you did and what you interpret the results to mean. It also allows others to repeat your experiment and hopefully repeat your results. You include a few things in a scientific report. A title, an aim, hypotheses, materials, methods, results, discussion and conclusion. The aim is the outline of your investigation. The hypothesis is the predicted outcome of your investigation with a justification for your reasoning. Your hypothesis should address the aim of the investigation. The materials needed to perform your experiment should be listed. The method and explanation of the steps taken to perform the experiment. The results. The collected results should be displayed in forms that are appropriate to your data. Tables, graphs and photographs must be included, but data is not limited to those formats. The discussion is an analysis and interpretation of the data or your results. This section of report shows critical interpretation of your results. In particular, it should consider the relationship between the results obtained and your hypotheses and the theory which the hypothesis was based. A conclusion is a statement of the conclusions you have drawn from the experiment and the results you have collected. It should satisfy the statement set out in your aim. You should also consider whether the hypothesis was proven and you make sure you use results you have gathered to support any conclusion statements you make. You can find out more below on what to include in a scientific report.